66 million years ago, dinosaurs vanished, leaving a world to be claimed by creatures you've never heard of. Meet Purgatorius. About six inches long and weighing just 37 grams, Purgatorius was the David to the dinosaurs' Goliaths. In this newly empty world, it seized every opportunity. With teeth built for both bugs and berries, it was an insectivore frugivore, part scavenger, part fruit picker. Sunrise, our hero emerges from a burrow, safe in the shadows, and sets off in search of breakfast. One crunchy beetle down, and moments later, it's an acrobat in the lower canopy, scouting for fruit. But life wasn't easy. Predators lurked, and every meal came at a risk. Survival hinged on lightning-fast reflexes and keen senses. Yet, every harvest fueled its tiny heart and, over generations, shaped a lineage destined to climb higher. Fast forward 65.9 million years. In Montana's Tulloch Formation, scientists uncovered these fossils, tiny teeth that rewrote primate history. Named for Purgatory Hill, these fragments revealed an animal perfectly adapted to a world reborn after the dinosaurs' fall. At the base of the primate family tree, Purgatorius marks the dawn of an evolutionary journey, leading to lemurs, monkeys, and eventually us. From tiny acrobat to tool-wielding hominid, it all began with this mouse-sized pioneer. Small in size, huge in legacy. That's Purgatorius, proof that big stories can start with the smallest heroes. Dive deeper, subscribe now.